Hi, I'm Jim McGowan with Raymarine. We're at the 2012 Miami International Boat Show, and today we're on board a 2012 Jupiter 32 equipped with the latest Raymarine E-Series multifunction displays. We've got this boat rigged with dual E125 displays, and it's got all the options on it. We've got GPS and chart plotter. We have our new Clear Pulse CP450C chirp sonar. We have high definition color radar. We have a T450 thermal imager some i70 instruments, and much, much more. We're gonna take you through all these different features and functions today and show you this great new navigation system from Raymarine. Our E-Series multifunction displays are equipped with our hybrid touch control system and our Lighthouse user interface. Let's take a look at it on the product. This is the E-Series home screen. You can see we've set it up with large, easy to use smartphone style icons. To activate an application, I simply touch it with my finger. With a hybrid touch control system, getting back to the home screen is easy. You can either touch home on the corner of the screen or use the dedicated home button. Customizing the E-Series home screen is easy thanks to our hybrid touch drag and drop feature. All I have to do is drag the applications I want where I want to see them in the display. Here I've got a tile with a full screen of chart. If I want to add radar to that, I can simply drag it into the interface. When I'm ready to save it, I just simply select finish the system will prompt me to give that tile a name. I can use my on-screen keyboard, easily type that in, and then I just press save. Now my tile is all ready to go, I simply touch it, and here's my chart and radar display. Lighthouse is Raymarine's easy to use user interface system found on our multifunction displays, instruments, and autopilots. Lighthouse places commonly used features in a nice vertical stack with things you use all the time placed to the top of the menu. The other nice thing about Lighthouse is that it's available in many Raymarine products, like this I-70 instrument. Lighthouse is so easy to use, you'll quickly become an expert at your electronics. The first thing you'll notice about the E-Series chart plotter is how fast it is. Every E-Series display is equipped with a dual-core main processor and a dedicated graphics coprocessor. As I range in from my widest to my narrowest chart scale, there's no hesitation and no redraw. The charts are just there. Another place we can see the speed of the E-Series is when I pan the chart. Watch as I swipe my finger across the chart and they just instantly appear. There's no hesitation or no redraw. Every E-Series multifunction display is available with high quality Navionics ready to navigate charts on a micro SD card. You can also upgrade to Navionics Gold, Platinum or Platinum Plus cartography. Every display has a dual micro SD card reader located on the lower right hand side so you can actually install two map chips in there at the same time. Another great feature of the new Raymarine E-Series is its built-in 50-channel high-sensitivity GPS antenna. It's built right into the display, so no external antenna is required. You'll get great reception on just about any boat. Every Raymarine E-Series multifunction display is built with a big widescreen 16 by 9 aspect ratio LCD display. They're available in a range of sizes to fit just about any boat. Here we've got two 12.1 inch displays but the E-Series also come in 9-inch or 7-inch versions. Another thing you'll notice about E-Series is how slim the bezel is compared to the big screen size. This makes it possible to fit E-Series big screens on many boats that were never before able to accept 12 or 9-inch screens. Another great new feature of the Raymarine E-Series is its built-in wireless technologies, including Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. Here I'm using Wi-Fi to stream the video from my E-Series chart plotter to this Apple iPad using the free Raymarine Viewer app. The app is available in the iTunes store for iPhone and iPad, and very soon we'll have it for Android devices as well. E-Series Bluetooth capability allows me to connect to accessories like this RCU3 remote control unit. The RCU3 is a simple three button remote that allows me convenient access to features I use all the time, like ranging in and ranging out on my chart display. I can even use the RCU3 to change applications. To do so, I simply hold the button down until I see the home screen, choose the app that I want, and press select. It's as easy as that. These are Raymarine's new i70 multifunction instruments we've got installed on the boat. They're brand new, they're very, very easy to use and configure, and they have a nice bright four inch LED backlit display on them. We can show just about any piece of information you might have on board the boat, including things like depth, speed and wind information, uh, engine data from NMEA 2000 instruments, and a lot more. Um, you can configure them to show analog instrumentation like we've got here. Uh, we can show multiple data boxes of navigation data like our latitude, longitude, course, and speed. 
I-70 even has AIS integration. In fact, it's the world's first instrument system that can interact with your AIS transceiver system and show you all your nearby AIS targets. Our boat's also fitted out with a Raymarine Smart Pilot X-Series Autopilot and our new P70R Autopilot Controller. This is our Autopilot Controller with a rotary knob specifically engineered for power boats. Another great feature we've got here is Autopilot Control built into the new E-Series multifunction displays. We've got a standby and auto controls right here on the display. We have integrated pilot capability. This is really nice on boats where you might have a tower or another installation where you need to control the autopilot uh, remotely. You can do it right from the MFP. Our E-Series system is equipped with our HD color radar. Now one of the great features of HD color radar is its amazing short range performance. We're here in the intercoastal waterway off of Miami and if you look just off our port bow, we've got a uh, wooden marker pole with a speed limit sign on top of it. Now we're marking it on the radar and it's just a little bit over a boat length away. The short range performance of this system is amazing and it's unmistakable. Raymarine's HD color radar uses 256 colors to help discriminate between weak targets and strong targets, making it easier for you to see what's going on on your radar display. It also uses Raymarine's exclusive digital processing technology. Now one of the benefits of digital processing is the ability to discriminate between small targets that are very close together. This is something that's extremely difficult for radar to do. If you look over our bow, we're approaching an anchorage here in the intercoastal waterway. There's about 10 boats in there, all in very close proximity to one another, and the HD color radar separates them with ease. You can see each and every individual boat on its mooring. You'd have no trouble in coming in there in the dark of night or in fog and knowing exactly what's around you. Another great feature of Raymarine HD Color Radar is dual range mode. On my E-Series display here, I've got my window split with two different radar pictures. On the left, my scanner is set to a quarter mile so I can get a close-in view of all the traffic right around my boat. On the right-hand side, I'm set at three quarters of a mile. This gives me the long range view I need to see traffic coming out of the river ahead of me. This is all done with a single Raymarine HD Color Radar scanner on top of my boat. It's a great feature. You'll find it on every Raymarine E-Series system with HD color radar. Radar overlay is another feature that you'll find on every Raymarine E-Series display. Here you can see I have my electronic chart with my HD color radar overlaid on top. It's a great way to see the entire navigation picture all on one screen. If you're new to radar, it's a great way also to learn how to reconcile radar targets with chart objects. Raymarine Radar does a phenomenal job of allowing you to navigate in darkness, fog, or bad weather. But if you want to take your situational awareness and your navigation skills to a whole new level, consider a Raymarine T-Series thermal imager with FLIR night vision technology. We're running a T450 thermal imager on this boat. I've got it alongside my HD color radar. That's one of the great features of E-Series. You can split the screen, use thermal and radar side by side. As we proceed through this anchorage, you can see the radar picking up each and every one of those targets, and the thermal imager does too. With this combination of technologies on board, there's nowhere you can't go with confidence. Now many people refer to thermal imaging as night vision, but the truth about it is it works just as good during the day. In cases of bright sunlight, when you're going directly into solar glare, your thermal vision camera allows you to see everything out on the water in front of you, like boats, traffic, buoys, channel markers, even people in the water. It's amazing technology, and it's all here on Raymarine E-Series.